Yeah, some unexpected changes happened. I went to uh, take this, you know, that saliva COVID test, you know, apparently they showed on the funnel, this and that, you know, sign, no pictures, no photograph, nothing like an airport, but I get it. And uh, another thing that happened today, you know, recommend you just like appear to use that funnel, just, you know, go through that, you know, that vial. You know, get the spit there. Don't don't show the bubbles. You know, get the spit there. You know, and not just that. Unexpected. Uh, you know. Also, you know, I got uh, applied for the career link. You know, my teacher, uh, Melissa, uh, helped me uh, apply for the career link thing. You know, thankfully. You know, just have to have my, uh, you know, the people I live with, you know, the, their job, this and that. Quite a bit of informa personal information about people, this and that. So I can understand why in the last days, you know, people betray one another, this and that. I understand that. And the surprising thing is, uh, you know, I saw somebody that, uh, I saw a female that reminded me of the snow. You know, bright snow reminded me of beautiful, good-looking snowflakes. And, uh... You know, I did explain to my teacher the reason why I keep, uh, it seems like I'm just walking around. It's actually because I keep going pee because of my condition, cranial insipidus diabetes. Because, you know, when I was 10 years old, I slipped and fell on a riverbed and, you know, back of my head cracked open. You know, that's, and as a result, you know, my kidneys, you know, the brain functioning of my kidneys, you know, to get it to absorb water, got damaged. That's why, you know, my kidneys don't really deserve, des absorb much water that's why I keep peeing that's part of the reason why I keep peeing and another thing that happened today is uh, surprising because I went to get the normal food that they lay out there you know there was this uh you know big woman that uh I really thank her you know she actually led me uh to uh she led me toward you know the place where they have food I mean the storage room it was quite a whole whole bunch of food Here's the bag that she gave me. I was able to get as much food as I wanted. That storage room, I mean, there was, there was a lot. I was shocked about the food they had over there in Spoon River College. And I can see that I have a better chance of surviving in the north than south. I was wrong. You know, I have came to the realization that south is an evil di direction for me, for my particular case, because the southerners, they're unruly. They're anarchists. Uh, you know, they're siggers, you know. But, uh, you know, I hope I didn't irritate, you know, the, the male, the, the male bus driver, you know, come in a bit, you know, well, he tend to go late anyway, but seemed to be on good terms, at least he didn't play the live music, but usually the music he plays is my time, and, uh, it is what it is, you know. I finished my uh, my life science on lesson two. You know the cells, you know, you know different different kinds of cells and all living organisms. I, I did that module on unit two life science on eye pathways. You know I did that, and I think I might go through it again. You know review it because you know I didn't quite get the concepts. Also it seemed like I only got now. I, I I think I might take a nap and all that. But there's probably things I forgot to. Uh, to say here, but it is what it is. Anybody?